here one more day. How's everyone going? So we're calling it a day. It's been a long day today. It's a hot one. Okay, so this is what it looks like. And now we're at the aesthetic part of the pond built. Now it's just decorating. Uh, we have all the mesh. Uh, I want to add that we had to remove all the mesh again. The reason why is because we had a surprise visit by the um, safety director of the YMCA. He said that one mesh was not enough, so we had to get a, a thicker wire mesh, which was an 18 gauge. So I had to take everything down and then reinstall it. So this is now with a double mesh. I don't know if you can see. It has the wire, 18 gauge at the bottom and then I have the other uh, thin wire mesh at the top initially the one we installed now I placed it on top that way uh, we know that thick wire it's a little sharp for the kids so for safety I put the, the plastic uh, covered mesh on the top so again for safety I added a little like bushes plastic bushes all around all around Okay. Okay. We added two more supports as well. So now we have one, two, three, four central dividers, which kind of help the lid more secure. That way, also as well for the mesh to have more support. Again, this is all for safety. Uh, it may not look that nice, but it's for the kids, so we have to adapt. Um, we finished all the bamboo walls We put them into the right amount of height for the pond. So we did that as well as we added some more dirt at the very bottom just for secureness again. That way no kids want to be tempted in order to pick up the bottom. So we filled it up with dirt as well. The back we are going to leave it six foot so on this one again you already know the connections are back here so this one we lift it a little higher for, for safety again um, another feature that I added and this is a dual locking system I added uh, let's see, let's see okay so I added two locks one on this side and one on the opposite side so it's secured by two locks, two different locks. So that one person that wants to do maintenance or if whoever wants to access the pond requires two different keys, okay? Two different keys to open the pond, okay? Again, it's for safety. Number one thing for this build is safety for the kids. So we're taking all the precautions needed, okay? Uh, here again, here we go. We, we covered the lock just so it doesn't seem tempting that people want to lock pick it or anything so we cover that with a little higher bamboo then we follow again the height the pong height again just to give it more of a view as well uh, right now I emptied all the dirty water the reason for that is because now um, the next step like I said is decorating now so we're gonna decorate the inside I'm going to put some rocks, some water plants that I already have down there. Uh, we're going to add some more, some more of these fake plants along the borders. Make it really, really, really nice. Uh, I don't know if you can see, but I added a couple here on the corners. Um, but it's coming along great. Um, again, it's, it's a one-man project, so it's one step at a time. So thanks for being patient. Another thing as well, we finished, I ran the, the extension cord through the PVC piping and we finished that as well as all of the un underground coverage. So if you can see, you're, you can't see the wire no more because now everything's under cover, under the ground. Okay, again, 35 feet underground. See, now you can't see it. Uh, I kind of try to make it blend in with the grass again. Um, it's a lot of dead grass, but it's 
it's there see so this is where it comes out this is where it's gonna exit it's gonna go through the PVC 90 degree elbow go up the wall and into this electric box where I'm gonna have to check to see whether they want the wire through the inside or if it's fine or again for safety if it's okay for them to just connect the outlet out here to the four outlets we're gonna add hopefully uh, I have to talk to the director about either getting an electrician or the maintenance guy um, at this but in the meantime uh, in order to test the pump and in order to pump the water out the filthy water um, I just I bought another 50 foot extension cord which goes all the way around to where there's electricity so either way we're making it work again slowly but surely I thank you for following the build please hit like subscribe and thanks for watching I'm sorry for the quality of the videos but again it's just me by myself so uh, I'm showing you that I'm not showing you when I'm working on it because it's it's hard I just want to really I do this on my spare time so I don't want to really waste time I come here and I just do what I have to do and we'll go from there okay so hopefully you're liking the build the next part again it's a fun part it's the aesthetics we're gonna decorate the pond the inside uh, I'm gonna fill it up again with clean water I already worked the filter at home I'm building it already so it's almost gonna be complete so probably next video is gonna be the filtration I'll show you a video of the filtration and how the the filtration is gonna work um, that's gonna be the next step filtration once we got filtration ready we're, I'm gonna cycle the whole pond maybe for like a week and then we'll introduce some fish into it uh, we have a total of uh, three turtles two that the school had one that's been donated by a parent and hopefully we have a fourth one so not bad you know it's growing the pond uh, everybody's excited to see the ending of the pond we're gonna have a grand opening so again thanks for following the build